Sasuke, no! Okay, sorry, me and the kids, we watch a lot of anime. This little ninja headband that I'm wearing is from a company called Muse, M-U-S-E, like the band, Muse. What it does is it takes EEG technology to translate brain and body activity into guiding sounds in weather. So as your mind calms, you'll hear peaceful weather. You can also wear it to sleep, to track your light sleep and your REM sleep. So this Muse product is also complemented with an app similar to Headspace and there are guided meditations on the app and you, you don't need the headband for that. And inside the app, there are categories that you can navigate. So like improving your focus, sleep, stress relief, and breath work. Now to get access to the guided meditations, you are gonna need to get a subscription. That's the same thing with Headspace. All these meditation apps have subscriptions. Muse is about the same price monthly as Headspace. Annually, it is less than a dollar a week for the entire year, so relatively affordable. But before we go any further, please, let's end world hunger by clicking the subscribe button. I'm not sure it works like that, but I do think it's worth giving it a shot. This is future Andrew taking a break from editing to give you a note, still being blown out by the sun. So when you buy the Muse device, the core biofeedback, that part is free. Okay, so the subscription that I just mentioned is for all the guided meditations and other features. Let's get back to it. Okay, so who are these apps for? Well, let me first briefly talk to you about meditation. See, you can download these apps and you can grab one of these pillows and then you can sit down and you can meditate. Or you don't even need these apps and you can grab one of these pillows and you can meditate. Or you don't even need one of these pillows. You can just get on your knees or sit down and meditate, technically. But I will say as a father of three with a full-time job and a running addiction, time is scarce and these apps help me, they motivate me to be a little bit less inconsistent or more consistent with my meditation practice. Wait, we're doing chapters now? Okay, let's just talk about my history with meditation apps. I've been using Headspace off and on from around 2018. Now, I'm not sponsored by Headspace. Andy, despite us sharing the same name, he doesn't know who I am. So let's quickly talk about that and then we can circle back to Muse. Okay, I guess we're definitely doing chapters now in this, in this V book, in this blog, in this cinematic literature. Uh, <laughs> oh, my wife thinks I'm so cringy. Okay. Anyway, Headspace, 10 out of 10 guys. I, I love it. You open up the app. You got five days, like five breaths to start your day. There's tips in there, a little three to seven minute segment, a daily sit down. You can set it for five minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes comes with a little nugget of wisdom. It's super awesome. And how I use it, I usually use it at night as I go to sleep. Not because I have any trouble going to sleep, but that's when I remember to meditate. So I just put in an earpiece and let Andy land the plane for me. And I have found that Headspace was very beneficial through COVID and as a runner on race day and at the beginning of races, I found myself finding my breath and remaining calm, calmer than I otherwise would be into a race. Okay, this is turning into a novella. All right, muse, disclosures. Is it too late for disclosures? Do I, do I have to do those at the beginning because I feel like I need to do one now? Muse sent this to me, okay? And I asked them for it because I saw it and I was like, wow, that's really cool. It's like the meditation plus the technology. Can you send it to me? And they did for testing and review. And what I was hoping for guys, to be honest, was that it would increase the amount of time or the frequency of meditation. However, spoiler alert, this thing, as cool as it is, it does not bend time. Okay, so I still have a full-time job. I got three kids who need a dad. And I, I think I'm the perfect guy for that role. So, you know, I, I sit in there. But while I did not sit down more often, I still did sit with it and I wanna tell you about it. Okay, so for my review of Muse, I'm gonna bring it in, I'm gonna get a little closer. Now you'll notice a couple things. One, the light from over here is no longer blowing out my face. That's a whole nother thing. The other thing is this headband, it is a little cumbersome to get right. It's, it's a lot to adjust, but to be fair to Muse. Okay, look, look at this. Okay, I'm, I've got an extra layer up here. I got a, I got a mezzanine 
All right, we're dealing with a certifiable five head, right? Like in, in eighth grade, this guy, Ivan Odio, straight up, a very angular face, he called me triangle face. That's just the sort of thing that stays with you for the rest of your life. Definitely had time to sit with that with the Muse app. Anyway, I do want to say, even though I did have a bit of trouble getting it squared away sometimes, once it was set, it was set and we were all good. Now, how am I using the Muse app? This bit, it's a little bit ironic, okay? Because this Muse app gives you a lot of data, similar to other wearables, whether it's your watch, the Oura Ring, the Whoop, if that thing's still around. It tracks your breathing, your heart rate, your sleep, and all of those other metrics. But for me personally, I am on a journey, guys. Uh, um, my philosophical approach to life is on the process and not the result. The data, it's been stressing me out. I don't want the data. I'm running more by feel. I want to sit, but I don't want to know all of those metrics. As such, I found myself using this app for the sounds and then the weather and some of the guided stuff, but not looking at any of the metrics that this headband provides. Either way, this Muse product is top shelf. Very choice, very premium. There's actually two headbands. Did I mention that? Is it too late to mention that? So the one that I have is called the Muse S and this headband here is cloth. So you could sleep on it and it can track your sleep and that's, that's good. It's $300. The other one, and that comes with the year subscription as well. The other one is called the Muse 2. That one's for like daytime use. You don't sleep with that one. It's more affordable, it's 187. However, it's near Black Friday. It's like Black Friday month or however that works now. And so it's 25% off. I'll put a code there if you're interested in meditation apps and stuff like that. Not from Headspace because they don't sponsor me, but Muse will throw a link down in the description. It's an affiliate link, so it helps the channel, helps me put hot and ready's in my kid's mouth, you know, some chicken ramen. Maybe we'll spring for the two liter at Little Caesars. That belongs, well that's, that's cute. All right, so the ep I'm not so sure we should put that because that's usually the part in the YouTube video where you start to hear epilogue in the guy's voice or the girl's voice and then you click off to another video while they're blabbing on about gratitude and saying things like, thank you for watching, ha <laughs> gotcha. Sasuke, no! Keep the same energy. Work on being better when I'm 70. Your drip is just a water stream. You know I drip different, it's the seven seas.